Welcome to Maths 1, 2, 3. So in this question, we have to find all values of x. If we see this equation, this is a biquadratic equation. It means we need to find four values of x. So first, we'll do some rearrangement to solve this question. So for that, I will multiply x minus 7 with x plus 5 and x minus 3 with x plus 1, which is equal to 1, 6, 8, 0. Now let me multiply these and these together. We know how to multiply. First I will multiply x with x plus 5. So this will become x square and then I will multiply this x with 5. I will get 5x. Now I will multiply negative 7 with x. I will get negative x and negative 7 with 5 will get 5. So into this again same procedure here x square plus x negative 3x negative 3 equals 1 6 8 0. Now see we will get here x square minus 2x. So if we, if we have to subtract here negative 35 into x square here also these are the say like terms. So we can subtract we will get negative 2x minus 3 which is equal to 1 6 8 0. Now I think it is clear why we have multiplied 7 x minus 7 with x plus 5 and x minus 3 with x plus 1 first so that we get here same terms means x square minus 2x and here also we are getting x minus 2x now let me put let x square minus 2x is equal to y so next i'll put here y so this will become y minus 35 and this will become y minus 3 which is equal to 1 6 8 0. Now we will multiply these. So this y square and then this y I will multiply with negative 3 which is will become equal to negative 3y and now I will multiply th negative 35 with y I will get negative 35y and this negative 35 with negative 3. So we will get a negative negative will become plus so we will get plus 1 0 y which is equal to 1 6 8 0 this will become y square minus we'll join these we'll, um, because these are like terms so we can add them so i'll get here negative 38 y and plus 1 0 5 i'll take this uh, 1 6 8 0 to left hand side 1 6 8 0 which is will come equal to 0 so now I'll subtract these. So I'll get y square minus 38y minus 1575 which is equal to 0. Now this is my quadratic equation. Quadratic equation. Now we know we can solve this by using midterm split method. So here I'll get y square negative 63y plus 25y minus 1575 is equal to 0. So I have split this 38 into two numbers such that if I multiply these two numbers I will get 1575 and if I sub subtract or add these two numbers I will get negative 38. So this will become I will take the, these two together and these two together and y, from here y is odd I'll I'll get inside y minus 36 and here I will I can take 25 so this will become y minus 30 uh, 63 is equal to 0 so y plus 25 and y minus 63 is equal to 0 so it means y is equal to negative 25 and 63 so we have two values of y we know y is equal to x square minus 2x now we'll put these values here first i'll take y is equal to negative 2 phi so in this equation i'll put this value this will become negative 25 is equal to x square minus 2x so this implies this x square minus 2x plus 25 is equal to 0 and if we see this equation, we, we won't be able to find the roots of this quadratic equation by term split method. So we have to use the formula that 
the roots of this equations are x is equal to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4ac divided by 2a. So here I'll find a. a is equal to 1 and b is equal to negative 2 and c is equal to 25. This I have got by comparing this equation with ax square plus bx plus c is equal to 0. So here I will put all these values. So negative b, so negative b, b is equal to negative 2. So I will put, I will get 2 plus minus b square which is 4 minus. So this here 4ac4 4 into 25 into 1. No need to write 1, 2 into 1. So this will remain same. So this is equal to 2 plus minus. From here I can take this 4 common and 1 minus 25 which is equal to negative 24 divided by 2. 2 plus minus the square root of 4 is always equal to 2. So inside I will be left with negative 24 divided by 2. So I will take common. So this 2, 2 and 2 into 1 plus minus square root of negative 24 divided by 2. So they will get cancelled. So 2 I got two values of x. These are x is equal to 1 plus square root of negative 24 and 1 minus square root of negative 24. Now, we will put y is equal to 63. We know y is equal to x square minus 2x. So, I will put this value here. So, I will get a quadratic equation which is x square minus 2x. So, minus 63 is equal to 0. So, 63 is equal to 0. So, if I take Use midterm split method to find the factors of this quadratic equation. See, if I take this as negative 9x plus 7x and negative 63 is equal to 0. So, if I multiply these two, negative 9 and 7, I will get negative 63 and if I subtract them, I will get negative 2. So, from, I will join them. So, I will take x out, x minus 9 plus 7x minus 9 is equal to 0. So, here I have x plus 7 and x minus 9 equals to 0. So, here from here also I will get two values of x. These are negative 7 and 9. So, four values of x are 1 plus minus square root of negative 24, negative 7 and 9. If you like the video, please give thumbs up. Do subscribe to my channel for more interesting videos and hit the bell icon for further notifications. Thank you.